Well, in the race for a vaccine, Pfizer is filing for emergency approval. And while we wait for a response from the FDA, a lot of people are concerned about getting the vaccines out to the public. And Vic joins us now with one Maryland company that's trying to help. Vic. Well, Denise, one of the things we've been talking about is the fact that these uh, vaccines have to be kept extremely cold, much colder than, say, your average freezer could keep them. So Pfizer is developing its own shipping containers. Now, these containers are filled with dry ice, which is where companies like Robert's Oxygen come in. The Maryland company is capable of producing roughly 3,200 pounds of dry ice per hour at its Gaithersburg plant. Vice President of Sales Scott Van Pelt said the company will absolutely increase production due to the demand, although he wasn't sure by how much. We really don't know the percentages yet. Again, it's the very early stages of this, so a lot of hospitals are reaching out just making sure that we have um, the ability to produce it, um, and that's really where it is right now. More information is to come. And the family-owned business says it is more than happy to do its part in the fight against the coronavirus, possibly save some lives. And the mind-boggling part about this entire thing for me is that this vaccine has to be kept at a temperature of like minus 94 degrees Fahrenheit. That's pretty cold. Back to you.